Wisdom Teachings from Archangel Michael by Rana Vazain, Sacred Scribe Activating the Crystalline Memory Seed Atoms of the Future Archangel Michael Quote Beloved Masters, you are now in the process of reuniting with your star seed soul families. You are now ready to begin to form some of your many Trinity soul units consisting of those souls who have activated and are consciously using all three God rays of divine will, divine love, wisdom, and divine active intelligence. Units composed of 3, 9, 12, 24, and 144 beloved souls. Many of these soul groups are in the formation stages on the physical plane. You, the vanguard, are now in the process of creating these wondrously empowered spiritual units. You are the brave spiritual pioneers who will become inspiring examples for humanity. You are also the ones who will provide the initial memory seed atom codes of Creator Light, the new divine blueprints for the emergent cities of light on the earth plane. In addition, there will also be many soul groups comprised of people who have never met on the material plane, formed within the new fifth dimensional unity sacred triad pyramids. These reunions and joint missions will be even more powerful and meaningful than the ones formed in person. Yes, my brave warriors of light, the long foretold era that you have all yearned and striven for is upon you. We of the realms of light rejoice in your victory. We stand steadfastly beside you as we all journey forth together to assure the divine plan for the new age is fulfilled. You are loved most profoundly. I am Archangel Mikael. End quote. Rana, quote, Dear friends, the time we have been waiting for is finally upon us. The null zone we have been in for some time now is over. It is time for action. We are strongly and clearly being given an important part of our new divine mission for the age of Aquarius. I have never felt Archangel Michael's loving energy so forcefully. He is emphasizing that during these critical times of transformation, we must take action now in order to ease some of the tremendous stress upon our Mother Earth, the Devi Kingdom, and the elements of nature. It is vitally important that you understand why our actions and participation are so critical. We are the ones who must bring in and anchor the Creator Light that will activate the new Divine Blueprint beginning with the activation of the crystalline structures deep within the earth, which contain the white fire seed atoms of the five higher galactic rays of consciousness. Also, we must consciously begin to work with the great Devic and elemental kingdoms to transmute and clear all the powerful destructive negativity that humanity has been spewing out into the ethers. If we do not, there will be even more destruction via powerful fires and hurricanes, floods and earthquakes. Universal law states that we must experience that which we create, and it is humanity that has created these powerful weapons of destruction. Archangel Michael has told us much over the years about how great crystalline structures were strategically placed deep within the Earth's surface when it was first formed. These great clustered spires contain the divine blueprint programmed by our Father Mother God for each sub-cycle of the seven great cosmic ages for humanity's sojourn within this sub-dimension. Our Earth, humanity, and all sentient beings are now integrating and processing the refined frequencies of the five higher rays of galactic consciousness. The blueprints for the seven rays of God consciousness for our solar system have also been upgraded to incorporate the first three sublevels of our fifth dimensional consciousness. Just as we, the starseed, light workers, have been consciously activating the semi-dormant crystalline structures and the violet flames within the great earthly caverns for many years, it is now time for us to begin the process of activating the crystalline memory seed atom programming for the galactic consciousness which is contained within these great sentient crystal structures. We also have programmed the memory seed atoms within our sacred heart and our sacred mind. Without even being aware of it over time, some of us have gradually been activating these precious seed atoms. We have also been performing the service of assisting in the activation of the memory seed atoms within those dear souls who are ready for this precious gift, as well as our blessed earth. 
However, as active champions of the light and bearers of the new divine blueprint, it is now time for this process to be understood and actively used with intention by all of us. Memories seed atom crystals and adamantine particles within the earth. Rana, quote, While in deep meditation, Archangel Michael told me that there are historical and scientific memory seed crystals stored within great subterranean caverns in strategic places around the world. These etheric seed crystals are in the same caverns as the violet flames, and both have an integral part to play in our present ascension process. The various sacred sites and holy places around the world have most often been built over or near one of these great caverns, or where there is one of the great crystal structures and spires. You will also find portals to the inner world near some of these special sacred sites. When we are guided to visit one of these special places, we may experience a most wondrous event of which we are not even aware of at the time. If your intentions are pure and your energetic signature and soul song resonate at a higher fourth dimensional level or above, you will automatically activate the appropriate memory seed crystals stored within the cavern below the sacred site you are visiting, for quite possibly you have performed this service before, perhaps many ages ago or quite possibly in a more recent past life. In turn, you will be gifted with an activation of some of the white fire seed atoms stored within your sacred mind. These will most likely be memory seed atoms, some of which hold advanced information that you will need in the future, or memory seed activation atoms, which will trigger the activation of a particular talent, or perhaps healing memory seed atoms, which will help you overcome some affliction or release a troublesome addictive habit. Throughout the Earth's history, there are stories of masters and great beings who accomplished amazing feats, won great battles, created many magnificent edifices, and performed amazing miracles through their own seemingly superhuman efforts. What has not been known heretofore is that these great ones knew how to draw forth some of the memory seed atoms from the great caverns within the earth. They had the capacity to draw forth a full measure of the first ray of divine willpower along with an added measure of creator particles of light and life from within the storehouse caverns deep within the earth. It is important that you understand that a good portion of the adamantine particles of light allotted to the planet were stored within these great caverns when it was first created. The balance was stored within the earth's sacred heart core. Every planet, galaxy, sun, star system, sub-universe, and universe within the omniverse has repositories of adamantine particles of life, light, and so has every soul ever created. Just as we must activate the adamantine particles we carry within and the ones we draw forth from the unlimited supply of creator light, we must also activate the adamantine particles stored within the earth through our loving intention and action. We are now moving into the vibrational patterns of mastership and we are being offered special gifts, talents, and specific dispensations to assist us in assuming our role as world servers. A new clarion call has gone forth for us, who came to the earth as members of Archangel Michael's Legions of Light. We are being called together once more in order to complete our current earthly mission. We have spent many lifetimes and endured tremendous trials and tests in order to heal our past and harmonize our physical vessels so that the memory seed atoms that were encoded so very long ago within our sacred hearts and minds could be activated. The keys and codes which will allow us to complete the group divine mission we were assigned by our Father Mother God for this sub-universe. Shine on, dear friends. Love and angel blessings. Rana. End quote.